And the 2024 U of A commencement is now one for the history books. And while the scene at the U of A campus was filled with joy and celebration tonight, with a very large police presence, it appeared protesters uh, stayed away. And that was not the case yesterday after pro-Palestinian protesters attempted to set up an encampment on campus grounds. When they refused to leave, law enforcement fired tear gas and rubber bullets to drive protesters out of the area. The University of Arizona Police Department ended up arresting two people affiliated with the university. But it was a different story tonight with those extra security measures. It appears the university's 160th commencement went off without any disruptions. News for Tucson's Jafet Serrato is live at Arizona Stadium now. And Jafet, how did the ceremony go? Monica and Sean, the ceremony went as scheduled. There were no protests inside or outside Arizona Stadium tonight. Instead, there were graduates experiencing their first in-person graduation. Keep in mind that they graduated high school during the pandemic. And as you will see in this story, they had a special commencement speaker tonight. T-minus 30 minutes until the U of A class of 2024 officially become graduates. Loved ones are seated at the bleachers. Students are capturing snapshots and just having a fun time. For many of the graduates out here Friday, this is their first in-person graduation. I graduated in 2020 in high school and I really didn't have a graduation. All I had was to you know, go pick up my degree. Philip Castro is a first generation college student. You can tell he's a family man because of his wardrobe. Each picture you see in these charms represents a family member who has passed away. He plans to make them proud with his human development and family science degree. I want to get into counseling work or even social services. So whether that's a job or maybe getting into grad school. For the ramparts we watched. Once the national anthem was sung, it was time for the 2024 commencement to begin. Numerous speakers came up to the podium to speak, but the most notable one to speak was actor and U of A alum, Craig T. Nelson. Many of the graduates grew up hearing his voice as Mr. Incredible from The Incredibles. Take what you've learned and to do for one what you would do for many. And these graduates plan to take Nelson's advice. I feel like with the public administration job, I can go out and still work out a lot of questions. And with the caps tossed in the air, University of Arizona now has thousands of new college graduates. We've hit this point where it's like, okay, now I can, I'm ready to get into life and figure out what I want to do. At least 8,000 degrees were conferred by U of A President Robert Robbins tonight. Live at Arizona Stadium, Jafet Serrato, News 4 Tucson.